pick has a lot to do with uh, how well you perform on a specific map? I think so. I think so, because if you don't have smokes, it's going to be hard to push along, t to push through long, you know? Yeah. Just like we saw in that last one. And uh, yeah, that's that's kind of a huge deal. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, chat, what do you think? Wh how do you feel about uh, the maps, uh, the map differentials and how teams have been playing on them? What do you feel is the most uh, critical thing for a team to have or to not have, uh, you know, fail for them on each of these maps and why? Right. Kind of want to get in, pick, pick brains a little bit here. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. Well, here's the sweep through on bind. Looks like we're going to be playing bind this time. Balanced map. Oh, yeah. <laughs> One of my favorites, still one of my favorites too. Uh, you know, you can play a lot of cues, especially if you have an omen on your team with the teleporters. Yeah. Uh, I love seeing those trick plays with him. Um, teleportation coming out. And just like I said, that this map I feel is the most balanced you have uh, as much of a chance on defense as you do attack. Yeah. And, and how you play it. Right. So here we go. We are running in to the first round. Pepper Spray versus Yuh. Pepper Spray is going to be on the defense side. Yuh is going to be attacking. And uh, let's talk about this team composition here. Yeah, for the, most, the most part it's a mirror, but you do have a breach for uh, Viper. Yeah, very interesting. I mean, Viper is really good on this because they're, it's not a huge map. So her ultimate, the Viper pick, can actually cover a lot of ground. Yeah, it can cover all of A or all of B. And... Even even on her way in, you know, the smoke screen getting in, you know, you have more coverage that way. Um, you know, her orbs, her poison orbs are great, you know, on top of the brimstone already right. smoked out a, a section there. So just lots of coverage on the side of, of pepper spray. Uh, but, you know, on the side of, yeah, you do have your breach, which is a little more aggro. Um, so I'm excited to see the play style of yeah. Uh, I love yeah. seeing great breach plays and yes. and just kind of like the face rolling so yeah. uh you know uh was that canoxians uh you know <laughs> i'm really rooting for you buddy i'm hoping to see some amazing plays here right i want to see some crazy flashes some some crazy tremors mm -hmm. i want to see a another aftershock kill we we got to see one aftershock elimination earlier today and that just feels so good when you get one <laughs> With Breach. Love it. And He's it's my so favorite. satisfying when you hit more than, like, two people, and you're just like, which one do I go for? Because <laughs> right. they, none of them can see. It's great. <laughs> All right. So we got a, a push, full push on B here. Three members of Pepper Spray are over at A. No one's going to change positions until they can get some intel. Some pre-firing through the smoke. There it is. There's the aftershock. Going to push him out, and they're going to get the headshot onto Canoxians. Or actually, sorry, onto Coil. Yeah, Woo! cleared that cubby out. Another great tool from Breach. You know, yeah. a a ability to clear out a cubby and force them into the line of sight. Oh, some double reloads here. Oh, no. <laughs> and they, unfortunately, Magic will go down the Canoxians. Down to a 2v1 situation. They are both very injured, though. Ooh, wow. Good cool. trade there at the end. Yeah, great, great trade. Uh, Canoxian's pulling that one out. Last man standing. Wow. 1-0. Up to ya. Yeah. And Canoxian's actually going to be a 3-0 and right now. He's going to be able to get some real good kills there, especially with that aftershock. Once again, it feels so good when you send that aftershock in there and you kind of see him running. You mm. got to see the <laughs> enemy team scattering. They were able to get that headshot on that person real quick. Real nice. You love it. I think I saw one shotgun. There, there we it go. is. <laughs> <laughs> that Ooh. round two shotty. Mm -hmm. You love to see it. Grenade's going to go out early. And it looks like we got another push here on B. Uh, we got two people rotating from A uh, almost immediately Ooh, here. Ooh, that's going to hurt. And they will be able to get there before they make a full push. It's slow, slowly three people coming up uh, long. And they probably know exactly where he is at with those gunshots on Roomba. Ooh. And yes, they did. Oh, no. He missed with the shoddy. Can't miss. <laughs> he can't miss. Bloodshot's going to pull pull out the elimination onto Canoxians. Right, 2v4 situation here. Bloody Show's going to get walled off. 
kind of in his favor, though. He's able to pick up that bulldog without any contesting. Yeah, true. So if he chooses to save, it's that'll save his backside. Mm -hmm. That'll be really nice. Now, here's a moment that I like to be a breach on defense in elbow. Because usually, whenever the spike's down, you you know someone's going to be in that corner behind U-Haul. So you can just put that aftershock into U-Haul. Ooh, he tried to get the double satchel. He kind of missed, though. Ooh. Yeah, if I was in that situation, I probably would have kept the the other gun in my hands yeah. for the, that long distance. I mean, you picked up the shoddy. Uh, I didn't expect anybody to be close enough for that to be effective. <laughs> right. That was kind of a rip there. Yeah, so here we are, 2-0 for ya. And unfortunately, Pepper Spray just, yeah, when they rotated through the back, they stayed at that back door a little too long yeah. rather than rotating over to elbow. Yeah. Uh, because if they could have, they they could have helped out their their brimstone who was holding off long and uh, had that second person. Right. Ooh, look at this camera positioning! Are you kidding me? That's like a free long. It's it's free. Wow, it's just a, it's just a free it's long free. peak. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, sometimes all you can say is wow. I mean <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no. Ah, and this time, Pepper Spray uh, does have three over at B instead of A. Uh, kind of realizing that they love to attack B here. Ooh, wow, look at that. That was quickly made uh, uh, made down to a 2v2. So good for ya bringing that one back after getting mowed down there and long. Right. You can see all the bodies. <laughs> I have the spike. Yeah. Fantastic kills from Duck here, though. Able to get someone through through cargo or through U-Haul, whatever you want to call it. That yep. was really nice. And the rotation has not come through from A yet. So uh, Yub yeah, being super patient here, uh, not giving away any intel, um, keeping pepper spray split. Uh, if they didn't know that the uh, other person from uh, pepper spray was not at B, they're making them rotate. Right, exactly. And that's the mind game that you play. So now they're, they're going to set themselves up for a 2v1 situation. Oh, Rotate now coming over. Yep. Pepper Spray now knows that they're on B side, so they're going to have to hurry up here. Going to really get the spike down. At least get the 300 extra credits. There it is. Through the cage. Oh, what? Unfortunately, Pepper Spray able to come around there and uh, clutch that out. Wow. That was beautiful. Just kind of got to spray it. Just got to spray it and hope <laughs> that yeah. you're getting it. Yeah, you're spraying in there. I mean, you had the, the right play. You did get down to about 14 seconds before they started to plant. Uh, so, unfortunately, just, you know, you either had to decide to try and oh, kill somebody nice or plant. Right. Yes. Not much you could really do in that situation, but get it done. And they tried. And that, you know what? That gave Pepper Spray their first, you know, their first round win. So, that's really nice. Yeah, I mean, that typically the first three rounds, you know, the score, uh, I don't think it means a whole, whole lot. You got two pistol rounds and, you know, but now now here, round four, this is, you know, everyone should have a gun. You know, you had your buys and, and now you really get to play the gun game. Right. That going for those, uh, going for those picks. Yeah, and this is a 3v2 split in favor of B once again. They know that they're going to go for B. Uh, and they're really heavily favoring this. They did send one person A, but they were taken out. So unfortunately, unable to make some noise over there. Still going to keep one person over at A just in case, though. Is the fault line going to, or uh, the Rolling Thunder? There it is. The Rolling Thunder is going to come out. But it didn't get magic out of the cubby, though. So they have no idea that he is there, and he's able to get one. Ooh. Unfortunately, not able to clear the head the second. Oh. All right, and that was a that was a great round for Pepper Spray. Unfortunately, Rolling Thunder did not clear the cubby, which kind of really hurt them mm -hmm. there. You want to make sure it hits far and wide. Definitely. That was actually, you know, I don't think that was a good ultimate from the side of Pepper Spray. I think they kind of wasted that ultimate because they knew it was a 3v1. I'm sure they knew they, they were up there, but they were really low. So I don't know if uh, the orbital strike was the best decision at that moment. But, I mean, <laughs> they won the round. So Yeah, yeah, and that's true. I mean, it's... 
Eh. <laughs> yeah, it depends on the person nice. playing. You know, if they feel confident enough that they'll be able to get another uh, ultimate here. I mean, if you think about it, he, he it only it's only six points for him to get his orbital strike. Right. It's not like it's seven. Uh, especially if you're the type to go out and get alt orbs or anything like that, you should be able to get you know pick that back up pretty quickly. Right. Try and clear out that little cubby there. <laughs> Sending it over. And sometimes you just want to kill with Orba. <laughs> True. It feels good when you get that kill. It's just like Aftershock. It just feels good. It looks like this is actually a save round for yeah. I think so. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, it's definitely a save round. Yeah, and yeah has once again gone for B site here. Uh, this is the fifth time in a row. So <laughs> I wonder if they're going to switch it up or if they continue to, to push B, knowing that that is uh, a strong point. Yeah, probably. But you know what? It could turn into not very strong. And they did take p Teleporter over to A, kind of playing those mind games there. So two members from Pepper Spray did go back over to the side of A. And the intel has been given out. Only uh, three people on the side of Yeah, down to two. Oh, no. Able to get the spike down, though. But this is going to be really tough for her to take out. Ooh, All right. Pepper Spray is. will get round five, making it three to two. That's really nice. That's really nice. Because Pepper Spray, you know, those first two rounds, they weren't doing amazing. But now, once they've gotten into the rhythm, they're doing some work here. Man, the Raze does have uh, her ultimate, so that is always fun Ooh. to watch her defend with that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, love to see that ultimate come out. And then, yeah. Yeah, you do have Viper Pit as well. So, yeah. I mean, she could, uh, or they could pop ult immediately. Well, not maybe immediately, but, you know, literally hold down an entire site within right. her ult. Right, and you love to see that. Maybe the, I mean, the Viper ult isn't insane on defense, but it is, you know, it is usable. Pre-firing here at the corners. Definitely checking that uh, favorite camera spot. Molotov's going to come out and going to get some uh, damage down on deck there. Almost insta-healed, though. Yeah, and this time, yes, yeah, split up the the attack. They also left the spike behind, too, to not give away any intel. Right. You don't want to push up and then get that spike down in the middle of the site. <laughs> yeah. We've seen that go very badly, very poorly for, for teams there when they're unable to recover the spike or make any other play. Ooh, a quick peek from Duck. Yeah, Duck making this now a 4v4 situation. And they will pick up the spike and move in on B. Still one player from Pepper Spray over at A. Oh. The Viper Pit does uh, come out here, see how much of uh, B. So they still are able to plant on the other side of that container. It did not reach all the way across, uh, but they will take teleporter, hop on over to A, and uh, they say, hey, you're gonna lose your ult if you rotate, so right. better that we'd rotate. Right, exactly. And that was a really fast rotate by them and kind of a slowish rotate by Pepper Spray. And so here they are. HN's actually gonna pick one up. Some gun battles going on here. Canoxian's going to pick up two. Oh, three. Make that three. <laughs> oh. Okay. Right. Yeah, Canoxian's now 8-4, doing pretty well on the side of, yeah. Yeah. And he also has his ultimate ready again. Huge. That's actually going to be really huge. If they can do one of my favorite things in the world, do that breach ult, the rolling thunder into the orbital strike and get a, at least one or yeah. two. Oh! You can't move. <laughs> it's beautiful, especially on attacker side because you know they're kind of holed up in a cubby somewhere. If you can hit those just right and you know bring them out, <laughs> yeah. they're done for. Or they end up scattering and breaking their lines, exactly. which makes it really easy to push in. Quarterfinals, it's now 3-3. We get some intel over at A, make some noise. There are three over at the side of A this time. It looks like two are peeking out from shower, so might see a really nice flank here from the side of Pepper Spray. Doing really well here, both these teams. That's a nice back and forth. Going to try and 
clear out that corner, but no one's going to be there at the moment. Probably clearing out Cubby as well. Ooh, Wilski is going to take a lot of damage. Yeah, and and he is, he did rotate all the way around. Short A is going to stop there. Here we go. Big rotation here. Ooh. And it comes out, but unfortunately taking out two of them. You have Coil, coil uh, with the shoddy. Holding down long. Ooh. Silent is going to pick up someone with that orbital strike, so that's going to be really nice to take over that site area. But the headshots coming out of Duck are insane. Yeah, and the trades I go back and exactly forth. Reddit right. Memer, his wow. position is now given away. <laughs> Reddit Memer, dude. Woo! Able to take out that spike and now also knows the position of the cypher. It's really huge. Spike is down. That was beautifully played by Reddit Memer. Oh, oh no. BM as well, oh, no. though. <laughs> well, I mean, Reddit Memer has got to live up to the name, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> right. uh, I don't know if I love it or if I hate it. You, know? <laughs> you hate to love it and you love to hate yeah, it. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. I need this. My Good stuff there from Ya, right? That was Ya, right? Or Reddit? Uh, it was Reddit Memer. So this is a side of Pepper Spray. Oh, Closing yeah. that one out. Mm -hmm. Taking the lead 4-3 now. Very close back and forth match as I'd love and I would expect from quarterfinals. Exactly. Exactly. Kind of getting into the really good teams, f playing each other, fighting each other. And, uh, you know, some of these teams are really going to have to kind of step up their game because, you know, I mean, even though they might have, you know, stomped a couple of, you know, a couple of teams or even one team, that could put them into a bad mindset of like, oh, I could just raffle stomp and just run out there and hopefully get a headshot. But now they're playing some good teams here. This is the quarterfinals. So yeah, you, you can never be too careful now. The, the later you get playing, you know, playing subpar teams will give you bad habits. Yeah. You know, and, and you know, you get gung-ho, you get it in your head that, you know, you're untouchable and, you know, you really get humbled in right. these later <laughs> matches. Yeah. Just like that, Coil's pulling out some amazing shots. Oh, great Ooh. reset from Reflect, uh, even though he's taken out shortly after that. All right, and congrats to Zachary, who won the giveaway for that four-pack of Red Bull. Enjoy. And so 3v4 situation here. Yeah, rotating back on over to A. We'll drop the spike to not give away any until the wall is up, though. Making some noise. I the spike. Right. Yep, that was the perfect move. Got to get the spike out of there, because if you drop the spike on top of those boxes, it's going to be hard getting yeah. it back. And this is now down to six seconds. Will they have enough time to plant this? He's going to have to put this down. Did he actually get that? Yeah, Silent uh, was able to take off. Whoa! Whoa! Unable to get there. Oh my gosh! Just a bit outside. <laughs> Unfortunate. That was so oh, close. Nice <laughs> so close. Just like a half a second. Not even a half a second. It seems like. Yeah. So we do have two alts ready uh, on the side of Pepper Pepper Spray, uh, Reddit Memer being one of them. So the res is available, and then the Neural, and then one point away for the Viper Pit as well. And then Duck uh, on the side of Ya yeah, does have their oh, ultimate yeah. available. Everybody else is kind of about halfway. And Duck has definitely been their top fragger. So if Duck is able to get off a solid showstopper, we've that'll seen be huge. A triples. We've seen quadruples with yeah. that. <laughs> Anything is possible with a showstopper. It stops literally the show. <laughs> exactly. I have this fight. All right, here we go. Another this rotation. I feel like uh, Yaz has been doing a fantastic job of like kind of uh, doing those mind games going back and forth from each side. Bloody Show is going to pick up Duck with a headshot, and that's a huge pick for Pepper Spray. Yeah, this is now a 3v5 situation. Going to be a little tough for them to, to kind of clutch this one out. <sighs> and they don't have that showstopper anymore. No. And another one goes down. You got Magic taking out Will and Ooh. Reddit Memer taking out Reflect. Reddit Memer. <laughs> Memeing on some kids right now. I'm just kidding. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, just Brimstone in 1v4 situation. No, no big deal. He's got the spike at least, right? Yeah. That's really nice. Yeah. Going to play back. Uh, possibly even save this round to... 
it's one v four. I mean, unless you're feeling confident, right? Which he might. Yeah, I mean, he's got all of his abilities. It looks like. Silently moving in here. No until yet, but there is a camera in Hookah, so he will get spotted out. Ooh, there it is. He hears it. Oh, man, and here comes the, the collapse. Takes one down, takes two down. You know, really, down. those cages saved him. <laughs> yeah, exactly. They covered his backside. He, he took out two from the teleporter, so at this point, he's probably saying, hey, thanks. Yeah, I'm looking <laughs> for that camera, though. Uh, still going to lose, but he's going to be able to save the Phantom and yeah, all of his abilities, he, he just, That wasn't bad. Yeah. I mean, he, he had two picks at the end. Right. You know, and he saved his weapon and his abilities. He doesn't yep. you know, have to buy much. And brought him two points closer to his ultimate. So he's now four out of six ult points for that huge orbital strike. And Canoxians is going to have his soon, too, I do believe. Mm -hmm. If I saw that correctly. Oh, four out of seven. Never mind. Oh. I think uh, we may have a little bit of a freeze here. I think our game crashed. Oh, no. Yeah, looks like that's going to be a crash, but that is, uh, I mean. Uh, All right. <laughs> well, so our game crashed and uh, we're working on things here. Uh, so we're. We're going to have to get back into this game if we can. If so we can. Give us a moment uh, to figure this out here. I uh, mean, that's like, <laughs> that's what it is when it's a closed beta, beta you know? <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes it just randomly crashes out of nowhere. Sometimes so. it be like that. <laughs> <laughs> it do be like that sometimes, for yeah. sure. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, when Apex first dropped, I couldn't even play the game. It crashed so much, so. <laughs> right. I mean, honestly, I think Valorant is off to a pretty good start, but. I, I think so, too, yeah. But, I mean, that, they're probably still going to be playing that match. Um, with what you saw, what do you think is going to be the outcome of that match? I mean, uh, we haven't even been able to see the swap or anything, <laughs> but it uh, looks like Pepper Spray has been kind of, you know, dominating. Yeah, Pepper Spray is finding a really good rhythm. Ya was doing a lot of the same things. And it looks like actually our footage is back now, so we're going to get back into the game. Woo! <laughs> Woo! There we and go. it is now 6-6, six, six, so okay. Ya wow. doing the turnaround here. Yeah. <laughs> Surprising us. Um, yeah. All right, yeah. <laughs> oh, okay, actually, that was uh, incorrect for a second there. It okay. is 6-4. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> but hey, yeah, putting a point on the board. That was really weird glitch to yeah. see. <laughs> <laughs> you love to see betas. You love it. All right. Um, so coming out with a, a big point on the board, I feel, you know, you don't want the, the gap to get too big between uh, mm -hmm. you and Pepper Spray. Uh, they are on attack, though. So I know some teams feel a little bit more comfortable on defense. Right. Uh, so being on attack, you know, it's 6-4. You can't feel too bad about that. And if right. they win this next one, it'll be feeling pretty good. But yeah, definitely switching up their tactics now. Uh, instead of being so heavily B-sided, uh, they're swapping over to A, which you know hopefully will give them some momentum here. Right. And they just saw the Viper go across. Go. Gonna clear is. out that cubby with a lot of firepower, <laughs> literally. <laughs> but for some reason, they're able to stay alive. The Viper is still alive. Yeah, I, I guess it didn't. Uh... Oh, here comes the party. <laughs> able to get one with the Showstopper. I feel like maybe the Molly didn't go far enough over into right. the cubby to, to really force herself out. But, yeah, uh, in a good position, 3v2, and Cypher, if he gets sneezed on, will fall. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> so got to be feeling pretty good, pretty confident here. But anything can happen in Valorant. We've seen some crazy stuff, some crazy picks. Ooh, that's going to be rough. Now it is just magic with <laughs> nine health. <laughs> <laughs> Don't jump. <laughs> right, exactly. <laughs> Please don't jump off. We saw that once today. We can't see it again. It'll hurt our hearts too much. Indeed. All right, so yeah, sitting in a, a you know pretty nice position here uh, to, to close this out and make it 6-5. Mm, Canoxian's going to get that get that a last pick onto magic. Yeah, and now you have uh, three ultimates ready on the side of Yav, one of them being the Rolling Thunder. And, and the and orbital, yeah. so you know, we might get that that special combination that's so dear to our hearts that we you know you love to see. <laughs> you love to see it, that's for sure. Yeah, I think uh, I think Brim and Breach are long lost cousins. You know, I they, think so. <laughs> they hang out at taverns all the time, <laughs> yeah. have beer, they collaborate these alts. Right. 
I mean, they're they've got to be cousins. They I mean, serve in the war together. Right. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Reddit meme are holding down that midsection there, taking a little bit of damage, but fortunately able to heal themselves. Oh. Oh, able to get the high ground. So Reflect knew that they were going to be up there, but Reddit meme are just you know able to peek his head and get that that headshot. I think he was able. Oh my gosh. Deck gonna have to back off here. Wow. Unfortunately, their sage is out of commission, so mm. she's gonna have to play the rest of this match pretty low. It's gonna be hard, especially with Pepper Spray. Have all five members up at full health. They still have three ultimates on the side of Yeah, though, so that's gonna be huge for them, especially if they can peek someone out and they can hit hit him with the Rolling Thunder, hit him with the or Orbital Strike and really clear out that area. Yeah, and they're, they're gonna chill over at A. So they cleared out Elbow, so that way they can move in into position here. Canoxians, oh, peeking his head, but taken out by Red at Mimer. So it looks like they should be able to get this spike down. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Fortunately, ran around. There's so much commotion going on. Uh, the side of Ya is gonna have to take out a couple more people before safely doing anything. Unfortunately, yeah. that does not happen. Yeah, that's gonna be really rough because they used those two ultimates, the Rolling Thunder and the Orbital Strike, but they, in both the cases, they didn't hit anything. Yeah. And that's rough. That's rough when you waste those ultimates and not know it. You know. Yeah. But lesson learned. Hey, I mean, it's seven five. This goes here. Uh, so you know we've we've hit the halfway mark. Not bad. You know yeah. seven five. I feel yeah. I mean it might as well be even. I feel like a seven five score is you can't be upset or right. or too happy about the lead either. You're just like all right seven five. Like right. <laughs> you know, it's it's kind of split down the middle here. Uh, they will swap sides. Let's see what Yug can do on the side of defense. Right. And what pepper spray can do on attack. Yeah, I mean the, the viper pit now when you plant the spike. Yeah. You know, yeah. you're able to hold that whole section now. Right. And, you know, they can't force you to move by leaving to the other section because right. you are on attack. So uh, it definitely comes in. in. Yeah, it has a lot more uh, utility when you're on the attack side, for sure. Yeah, definitely. I lost my words for a second. Thank mm. you for picking that no, up. No, I feel you. I feel you. <laughs> I, feel you. I, I think the, the words I was looking for was more worth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, so Pepper Spray, uh, a bit opposite of Yeah, They're attacking A side heavily. But there is a rotation coming out from the side of Yeah. From behind. There it is. Oh. A big trade there. They're going to they're gonna be on the spike at the moment. Ooh, wow. Oh, amazing flying shot from Bloody Show. That was impressive. Getting around, getting two more shots off, getting some damage on the, the Brimstone. To Doing stop that work. diffuse. Ooh. Wow. Bloody show putting on a good show. That's exactly. for sure. Oh, no. Oh, no. Fortunately, almost <laughs> killed themselves, but able to, to close that one out. Somebody clip that. That was, that was insane. Are you kidding me? The satchel into the beautiful sh uh, shorty shots, <laughs> I guess. That was just, I don't even know what happened. I don't even think Ya know, knew what happened. <laughs> Shorties. <laughs> A flying shorty yeah. headshot. I mean, I, that, was, that was great. That's what you, that, those are the plays that you want to see from Ray's. You oh, know, yeah. that she is the duelist. You know, she satcheled herself out to stop, you know, the, the diffuse, you know, landed on somebody without getting taken out, mind right. you. And then, you know, able to close it out by themselves. Pretty sure. Red Bull gave her wings, for sure. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> nice econ round here. That's a, this is a big... <laughs> oh, my <laughs> gosh. Yeah, it's going to push out all five members from Hookah and <laughs> just unleash bullets into people. <laughs> wow. Going to take out two. <laughs> pretty amazing there um that was a, a crazy strat i have not seen before so now you have all the members of pepper spray in the backside <laughs> of the spawn so a complete flip um they did make it a 3v4 situation here 
Wow. And they're going to rotate on over to A. And yeah, well, uh, they are making a rotation here. They, so Pepper Spray should be able to get this spike down, no problem. Wow. I just rewatched that <laughs> that uh, Ray's play. That's ridiculous. Did somebody clip that? Make sure we get that clip. Yeah, make sure. <laughs> All right, here we go. Showstopper's going to be pulled out. Is he going to be able to pull anything It up? was a Not. whiff, unfortunately. So you got Coil here holding it down all by him's lonesome. <laughs> him's lonesome. <laughs> I love it. Wow! And he gets two of them. So now it's a 1v1 situation. Very doable for Coil here. Is this going to be an ace for Coil? Oh. It's not. And the jump down shots. Canoxian taking out the Coil. Valiant effort there. Beautifully played. I mean, he hid in the correct position. But unfortunately, unable to uh, really pull that out in the end. So, yeah, making it 6-8 now. Man, I know when I get in those uh, situations where I, I, I could pull off the ace and I'm by myself. You know, the nerves start kicking in a little bit, and you whiff those couple of shots at the beginning. It just feels bad because you know you could get it, yep. but <laughs> just, you just don't. You got to brush that off, you know, wipe your hands off on your pants and, uh, you know, <laughs> yeah. get the sweat off of them exactly. and, and just get back to get your head back in the game and, and do it. You know, you almost had it. It either feels real good or real bad, but <laughs> right. either way, you brush it off. <laughs> right. I mean, he's still got the 4K, which is really nice, and that's going to be really good for their econ, so beautiful. Beautiful. Here we go. Slow push. A a short with one straggler out on hookah, clearing it out. Probably trying to get that intel. Silence yeah. gonna take out Coil. They know somebody is there in, but they will take the uh, the teleporter on over to hookah, which all the sounds and cues. So uh, you know they're gonna send some stuff through that teleporter there. Yeah, definitely. I love that you could send a Roomba just straight <laughs> through. <laughs> you can send mollies through it. You can send grenades. It's Crazy. Great. <laughs> great way to clear it out, too, especially if you're trying to get that uh, info on where they're at. Absolutely. So slow rotation back on over to A. There are three people over at B, so this is a better situation for them. And there is a full, you know, back rotation from the side of yeah to clear people out unfortunately goes down so now it's a 1v5 situation magic gonna have to make some magic happen here if he wants to close this out but he is getting pinched <sighs> and it is a flawless round for yeah and bringing it to seven eight yeah <laughs> that's all i could say yeah sometimes it is all you can say sometimes it's all you need to say <laughs> yeah, exactly <laughs> Well, anyways, that makes seven to eight and still in the favor of Pepper Spray, but yeah, it's been, you know, <laughs> just a back and forth. Yeah, uh, Coil does now have his ultimate as well as Canoxians on the side of Ya. And it looks like Silent is one away from his orbital. So we'll see if he can get that out this round. Prepare for help. Wow. Opening up, clearing out that elbow. So going to do a hard push on the side here, but Canoxians waiting. Oh, Ready. Huge. This could be huge. Oh, the slowing orbit is going to be huge on the side of Ye or, uh, yeah, Pepper Spray, though. And the cage keeping them protected as well as, uh, you know, some smokes here. Fantastic big brain play on the side of Pepper Spray. Give themselves covered. Reddit Meeber's going to take out Canoxians, which is going to be a huge pick. Ooh, and Reflect taking down Bloody Show. Picks going back and forth, back yeah, and forth here. This is now a 2v3 situation. And they're going to wall that off to get that defuse going. Whoa! Pepper spray able to burst through that wall, clear it out. So this is now 7-9. Wow. I mean, that was that was a great strat. Wall it off, try to defuse yeah. it as fast as you can there. You got to do what you can, but there was the Viper coming through showers. So even if... Uh, they didn't get through the wall. Sh you know, Showers would have been able to come through and get that pick. Yeah, and good job from Pepper Spray to, to, to really throw out all the protection against that that breach ultimate right. that came through. You know, that, that could have been, you know, clutch, but they were quick on their feet. They covered their sides and made sure that they were very well protected. Right. You love to see it. Some sky smokes coming down. Viper wall, walling off. Short there, just to give their teammates some coverage. 
Reddit memer going through showers, trying to get some info. There is a nice wall, uh, and you know they should be able to get a successful plant off here. Looks like it. Looks like they have a free and clear plant, but they heard some footsteps up in heaven. Are they going to be able to get this? I'm going to throw the slow orb down. That's going to be a huge grenade. It's going to do some damage there. I put that wall out. She has a teammate watching their back, so able to get that spike planted just fine. Ooh. The operator from heaven. Some scary stuff. Ooh. Wow. Oh, fantastic headshot from Reddit Memer on Reflect there, taking out that operator user. There is a pinch coming from behind. Ooh, Noxian is going to be taken out by Magic, and Coil is going to finish it off with a kill onto Wilski. Yeah, and Pepper Spray, Pepper Spray go up 10-7 now. And these have been really close rounds. Uh, you know, it's, it, it hasn't been one, you know, face rolling the other. Right. You know, only one or two rounds where, you know, they kind of come out swinging and stuff like that. But, I mean, there's there's been some punches thrown back and forth. Uh, I think there was only one flawless round so far right. in this entire thing. Yeah. So, you know, this is really great play from both sides. Yeah. We're seeing really good uh, usage of their uh, utility yeah. and, and everything. Yeah, yeah, stacking over at A here. Very interesting. Are they about to do that same thing that they did last time? I oh. think so. <laughs> <laughs> the so Cypher figured it out really early and was like, I'm out of here. Get, get me out. <laughs> and with that intel, Pepper Spray is going to move into B for a free plant. Yeah. Here That's the is. only downside to doing this strat. Right. Is if you leave nobody at B, they will get a free plant, and then all of a sudden you're on attack. All right. Full hold here from Pepper Spray. It's going to be a little rough for Ya to get in there because they have now been in like ingrained. And there it is. Coil's going to get a twofer there. I just realized this. a lot of them have pistols. So with this being a save round, maybe they just kind of, you know, yeah. went in there. I, th I think that was the case with the last one, too. Yeah, you know, you're, you're better in numbers with pistols. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> definitely. If there's five of us shooting you, you're going to drop just as fast. <laughs> right. So Pepper Spray making it 11-7 now. you got to be getting kind of worried if you're, yeah, you know, two points away from uh, the game ending on you. But they are able to do a full buyout now. Yeah, you see an operator oh, there on Canoxians. He's been doing some work on it. 18 and 12. Um, and so is Silent. Yeah. And also 18 12. So two heavy hitters, and you also have three ultimates uh, Duck, Wills, and Reflect. Once again, they're they're doing really good with their eliminations on the Yuz side, but they're just not closing finishing out. Yeah, <laughs> not closing out the rounds. That was interesting. That's <laughs> spray pattern. Spray? <laughs> uh, wall raise. All right, wall raise. Reddit Memer, able to get the spike planted once again. Ya is now on the side of attack rather than defense. Oh my gosh, Wilski's going to come around the corner and take out Bloody Show real quick. And they will see each other here. Uh, HNSM able to pull that one <laughs> off. I'm just going to say is that handsome. handsome? I think it's handsome. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Duck took out Handsome. Uh, the wall is up in order to defuse here. Popping over that wall. Woo! All right, and yeah, getting that much needed round, making it 8 11 here with four teams still remaining. So that'll save a lot of their economy as well. Yeah. So good job, yeah, clutching that one out. Uh, that was a nice rotation from B to A, taking mm -hmm. that teleporter. Uh, and, and winning that duel over by showers. Yeah, getting those one taps, those were really nice, and they really helped out a lot. And, but you do have a full side of ultimates on the side of Pepper Spray now. Yeah. Everybody. <laughs> that's going to be huge, especially with the Viper, you know, that Viper Pit. If they get that spike down, yeah. just Viper Pit and just do everything else. Just let it all go. It's going to be hard to retake. Especially, they, you know, with Ya, yeah, they don't have a Sova to get any kind of intel. I mean, you can maybe throw a Cypher Trap in there. Right. Uh, you know, try to clear some things out. Got a slow push into B with uh, two. Uh, one over at A, one watching short, making sure they're not getting flanked. Smart. 
yeah, it's about to. Someone on this corner is about to see a lot of people. Indeed, they don't see each other yet. He probably heard that gadget come out, though. Mm -hmm. my wire. Here he goes. Oh, oh, and they peeked it. They knew they sensed it. Somebody's here. And if you're if you're not pre-firing your corners like that, <laughs> yeah, you're not right. doing it right. Exactly. <laughs> and you're there not goes playing the, the game viper right. pit. Yeah. So yeah, I mean, you know, it is eight eleven. Do you save and hope for another day? It looks like that's uh, right. what they're going for. Viper Pit is really hard to get into, and they, they realize that. So they're just going to save what they can and go in uh, with a match point against Pepper Spray. <laughs> yeah. Three people saving, and you know what? They've got to really come out strong with this. You know, really come out strong with this because Pepper Spray still has four ultimates mm -hmm. plus, <laughs> you know, it's going to be tough uh, yeah. for you, but this is one of those games where you can see a 4 0 5 0 run. Yeah. And, you know, you can see it, you know, come right back. But they are going to hunt, though. Ooh. My, oh, no. No, and they will get two of them. Pick up that up. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, Unable to pick up the operator at the last second there. So, Yaz economy going to be hurting just a little bit. Got one operator in the hands of uh, Canoxians. But Pepper Spray sitting on match point. Got to be feeling pretty good. Pretty good indeed. They are on match point. Yeah, it's going to have four ultimates. That'll be nice. I don't know if Ray's is going to have one in this match. No, it's got one out of six ult points. That's going to be a little bit of rough trying to get that ultimate out, especially the showstopper. But, uh, here we go. Yeah. This is their last shot, basically, unless they're able to win this. Here we go. All right. And they are going to peek over there in long B. And you're going to see exactly Will gets see. two <laughs> picks. So much needed uh, picks early on from the side of Yeah. They know that the spike is over there. So you're going to see that rotation from A to watch the short. It's going to be an interesting push here. Lots going on. Absolutely. Ooh. So your pepper spray, you're just kind of really thinking, all right, what do I do here? Do I still go for B? No, there's another pick coming out, and now this is a 2v4 situation. Neural comes out there. I don't know if that was the correct time to use that. Yeah. Uh, you're down quite a bit of, of players. I mean... Hey, I mean, sometimes you just kind of throw it out there in a desperate attempt to, to kind of get away. But we are looking at 9-12 now. Yeah, hanging on. And now we have three alts ready on the side of Yeah. You know, you got your you got your breach and brim combo. Plus, you have the, your res. Right. Uh, so you're you're sitting, you know, pretty, and your economy is not too bad. Yeah. Yeah. So that was a much needed win on the side of Yeah. You know, one thing I have been noticing, though, is their Sage has been peaking a little bit way too much. So I think Sage should back off and be ready for that res early. Wilski's going to take someone out. Bloody How is going to take out Wilski in return. And that Sage wall is going to go up. Yeah, the res will come through. Woo! Uh, unfortunately, did not pick anybody up with that showstopper. But this is now a 3v3 situation. Teammate will pick it up. It's a rough spot. Yeah, and there is a uh, a flank coming through the side of Yeah, slow and steady. Yeah, <laughs> trying to get that intel. Two ultimates though. If if Brimstone can get that ultimate down right when they hear the audio cue, yeah, they hear that spike going down. Use that breach uh, the Brimstone ultimate. Oh, here it comes. There it is, and there it is. The double. Unfortunately, unable. They they hopped right in that corner, so they should know that they are chilling in that corner, being safe. Canoxian's taking them out with the op, and Pepper Spray just kind of making their way around, still wanting to hold oh. down this B site. But Spike is now dropped in the corner, and they got sights on it. All right, this is a 1v3. 
Handsome is going to take out Duck, which is going to be a huge advantage for him. Except for that operator is still, still doing some work. And now there's no time to, to plant there. Oh, so, oh, yeah, oh. staying in the game, making it 10 to 12, clawing their way back. Clawing their way back is the right way to put it because they are fighting tooth and nail to get these wins out. Reflect kind of bottoming out in this matchup, though. So I think Reflect needs to step it up a little bit in their positioning and, uh, you know, getting some of those kills down. But, you know, we'll see what happens. Yeah, it's, it's hard as a Sage, you know, if you're if you're peeking a little too much, you know, it, it kind of puts your, your team in a deficit if you don't have your heals and your walls and stuff like right. that. So if you go down before you put your utility to good use, it just it really starts to feel bad. <laughs> yeah. Definitely. If you're pepper spray, yeah, you might be feeling a little sweaty now. Especially with that opening kill. Ooh. They will trade it out, though. Yep. Uh, Res coming through on the side of pepper spray, but another one taken down. You got Duck taking out Handsome. So, 4v4 situation once again. This is a matchup. Yeah. Once again, uh, 10 to 12 here. S sitting on match point for three rounds in a row with <laughs> pepper spray. Looking to close this out. And they're fighting for it, too. Absolutely. Ooh, it's going to be bad. This is a 3v4 situation now. As the stage taking out 3v3. Still got 54 seconds left. Full rotation coming through on the side of Yeah. They got the spike down. So that's that's good for, the, for Pepper Spray. Duck's going to have to pull out some crazy stuff again here. And I'm, and I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. Oh, unfortunately, got blinded by their own teammate. Been stepping out. You hate to see it. Oh, it's rough. Yeah, it's rough. And, you know, and it happens. It, it does happen. Wow. All right. Silent in the 1v1 situation playing for his life. He does <laughs> not have the time, though. He has to go in for a defuse. Oh, no. Is this going to be it? I don't know if he has enough time. Uh, he does not, oh, unfortunately. No. <laughs> oh, no. Valiant effort from the side of Ya and GG's to Pepper Spray for closing that one out. Congratulations for moving on, guys. That was <laughs> insane. Fortunately, wow. you just you got to play the time game, and, and t when time's against you, you got to make moves, and right. you can't wait for smokes to clear. And <laughs> yeah. I mean, I, I I don't think Cipher had a clear. Uh, shot actually where he was shooting I think he could have gotten it halfway before right. that smoke went away yeah got and a little scared got in the nerves yeah sweaty hands <laughs> yeah. it's match point you're defusing <laughs> you know someone's right over there yeah I get a little sweaty yeah oh man uh, you hate to see it but GG's to both teams they both played great that was uh, oh gosh, a yeah. great quarterfinals to put up on stream here yeah I'm glad it wasn't a blowout I don't want to see those. Not in quarters. <laughs> right. Not on stream. Um, and got some really cool clips from that. I, I mean, Duck with his amazing plays, oh gosh, just yeah. <laughs> satchel with a shotgun. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> just I'm, coming in all willy nilly. <laughs> yeah, I hope we got that clip there. I hope we did. Yeah, well, absolutely. I think we're going to go into a quick five minute break and then go back into some more stats from that last match because that's going to be a fun match to actually get into the stats because uh, they did a fantastic job, both teams. Yeah, absolutely. And don't forget, uh, exclamation Red Bull to win this lovely four pack. Uh, that should be coming up soon as and well. I think that's the last one of the night, too. I'm pretty yeah. sure. Yeah. So make sure you enter your name in there into the chat and stick around. Share the love. Follow us on our social medias. And thank you to Esports Gear, SKR, Veeam and Tactics, and Gamer Arena, of course. We'll see you back. <laughs> 